Papa Texas Unfiltered. You don't have to watch this. I'm just going to ramble on about some things going on in my life right now. <laughs> That's up to you. You could leave me a thumbs up, though. You know? <clears throat> so Gigi's gone for a week. Yeah, things kind of change when she's gone. Not much. Uh, my eating habits change and everything else. I'm trying to do better. I got some carne asada going over here on the smoker right now. Uh, that'd be about three meals for me. I bought hot dogs, hamburgers. <laughs> we got it all going on. Oh, wait till you see my uh, ice maker fix. Um, I found out something about an ice maker I had no idea about, and I'm getting it taken care of. I'm in the middle of that video right now. That's right. This week, what's going on with Papa? Yeah. This is right here. That one. I'm getting a root canal on it. Uh, actually, tomorrow from 3 to 5. That's right. I'm not looking forward to that. Do you know all these are fake? Yeah. That's because of something that happened. We're not going to talk about that one. That's way unfiltered. <laughs> and then what happens at the end of the week? Oh, I get my colonoscopy. You know, you do need a colonoscopy in all seriousness. Um, also, an endos endoscopy because I dip stuff. And you never know if I have cancer in the throat. And my little flapper at the top of my stomach doesn't do too well. Yeah. It doesn't like El Phoenix. It likes El Phoenix until the very end when I drink too much water or tea because they keep filling my glass up and then I have to, you know, um, let a little bit go just to feel better, if you know what I mean. That's just a personal problem now, ain't it? <laughs> anyway, um, some videos we got coming up. Uh, I'm going to be cooking fried peanut butter and jelly sandwich it's gonna be just like if you made uh grilled cheese you know i wanted to wait on maddie but man they're, they're just so busy so i'm gonna go ahead and I'm, i've got the stuff i'm gonna make that one i got this uh flying saucy hot wing sauce we're gonna be making that one i'm doing a taste test we're gonna see how you know i didn't i didn't do hot stuff and cajun stuff until more recently and it's due to my uh, YouTube cooking friends that I have, over the last few years, stepped out and started doing that. Booger's a good one that's uh, taught me, because I think my taste test is, my taste buds are similar to Tom's. And, uh, I mean, when we, we, were, we were all sitting down together, Booger, Tom, and I had Hooters, and uh, I think she ordered, or he ordered, whatever, the... Uh, the hot shrimp appetizer or whatever, I had no problem with it. And uh, I've, that's a new world for me, y'all. So I'm enjoying that. I Yes, I do not make as many videos anymore. We are a lot busier at work. Plus around here, by the time I get home during the week, it's dark. I gotta rely on these lights. Oh, check this out. How's that? I put a brand new work light up there. And it's awesome, man, at nighttime, I turn that sucker on and I can see everything, get everything done. Uh, Cause you know, Papa cooks outdoors year round. I don't care if it's snowing. I got this 40 by 12 and I've got another area over there covered. Uh, it don't matter. I got my heater over there. I bring it over here, turn it on. It heats up the whole area. Uh, we're fine. Uh, this is where I cook. Oh, was I, did, I finish, did I finish talking about the ice maker? Anyway, I'm fixing to go in there and I'm gonna finish that video up. I need to clean my lens, it's dirty. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, Gigi retires at the end of this year. The 31st, she's so excited. The only part she ain't excited about is I still gotta get up and go into my job every day. Uh, I do own my own business. Um, uh, I lost my insurance, well, I lose my health insurance on December 31st because I go through her. My company 
everybody's going through their wives, so we didn't need it. Well, I've changed that around, worked on it. I've got a fantastic idea that I did. It's going to, well, it's still going to cost me money, but not as much. So we'll get that going. That's why, you know, I'm going ahead and taking care of a couple things with this cheaper insurance this year. What else I got for you? Oh, check this out. If you saw my video, this is my new pizza stone. Um, I don't bring her things out here and cook on them. She's got her things, I've got mine. So she has on not just pizza stones, but on stones. Gosh, Gigi probably has seven, ten different kind of stone cooks and stuff. And man, the patina on them. Just they, she's been cooking on for years. And in reality, you don't have to season them. It just speeds up the patina process. Okay, does that make sense to you? And plus it made a video, you know. <laughs> We're gonna cook more uh, things on this than just pizza, but we're gonna do some pizzas. And what I looked at was, I was gonna buy one of these pizza cooks, and they're like 600, 800, 1200 dollars. It's like, for a pizza? Get a rope. So I thought, you know what? I'll spend, I don't know, 40 bucks on this, and then I bought uh, the pizza peel slider thing. I got that. I thought, man, I'm, I'm loving the Z Grills pellet smoker. I'll just, for 40 bucks, I'm making on that. You know, I can get it up to 400 and something degrees. The stone, I can get up to 450. And uh, yeah, we're gonna start having a little series with uh, making pizzas. So we'll be doing that. Um, I am, I'm gonna make pigs on a blanket on this. I don't know if it'll be on a video or not. Uh, and maybe if it goes well, or maybe I'll just put it on a video. I, I, I don't know. I'm just making pigs in a blanket. Who, who doesn't like pigs in a blanket? And you dip it. What do you dip it in? Tell me. That's right. Mustard. You got it. <laughs> pigs in a blanket. Oh, on, on Christmas morning. Gigi always makes pigs in a blanket and sausage balls. And she makes fantastic sausage balls. But, you know... Because of her arthritis, I have to go put these gloves on and I have to be the one to mix it all together. And uh, I didn't realize how much it took for her to do that. Because <laughs> I've been doing that for a couple years. But I'm not the best ball roller, especially if you've seen my uh, sausage balls video. Um, I make them too big. I don't know why I do that, you know. I'm a guy. And if I roll them, she has to turn around and re-roll every... She pulls a little meat off of them and re-rolls them to get them the perfect size. And your sausage bowl... Your sausage ball at the end is supposed to be round, not flat like an oatmeal cookie. I've seen people make them like that. I think it's too greasy. Or your heat ain't high enough. I'm not sure. All right, what else we got for you? Oh, and I think February... I'll be going down to Houston, to the Houston Rodeo. Uh, I'll be staying with Uncle Steve from Uncle Steve Shake. I'll be staying at his house. But uh, I'll be seeing a lot of YouTube cookers down there. Um, there's going to be quite a few, and it's going to be pretty fun. They went last year. I, I didn't go. Um, but I plan on going this year. Uh, we'll get that behind us. Oh, check this out. Check that out. This is to have some fun, let Maddie have some fun. It's called Dash Egg Bite Maker. You will probably see this on my videos, on my main page. All right, we're gonna call that a wrap. Be sure and check out my Amazon store if you ever care to. And I tell you what, you go to any of my main channel videos, and you're gonna go buy something at Amazon, all you gotta do is go to a Papa Texas video, go down into the description, click on the Amazon, you buy it. I don't know who you are, but when you buy it, it's like tipping Papa. It costs you nothing more. It's just I get a little piece of the money off of that to help my channel out. Because my channel, um, I'm not actually on YouTube and 
making as many videos or anything else anymore. I just haven't, uh, maybe I'm worn out or tired of it. I don't, I don't know. Well, there's somebody coming in, but um, that would actually help a tad more. And I would appreciate that. I got one video out there. It's uh, taking the rust off of a flat griddle or black stone. And I tell you what, I leave a link to the grinder that I use, the grinding wheel. And I sell a couple of those every single day on Amazon. Ain't that cool? That's my number one go-to from, from YouTube to Amazon and buy something. The other one is uh, the one about putting a, a new pump on the pool. And that one's cool because it just comes around usually when it's pool time, the beginning of pool time, people watch that. And they freaking go and they buy the whole $350 system through me. Now that is really cool. That's usually February, March, April, May, whatever. Uh, that's kind of fun and everything else. Well, I don't know how long this video is. I could go on for three hours. Maybe I should do a live over here. <laughs> anyway, appreciate y'all. Y'all have a blessed rest of the day, rest of the week. God bless you. God bless the United States. Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm biting my tongue not to talk about that border. Or Afghanistan. What a mess we got. See you.